Google leaks reveal a smartwatch, a game console, and another Nexus Q. Android 4.3 gets leaked for the Galaxy S4. And BlackBerry keeps pushing more and more bad news. I'm Jaime Rivera. And now that it's Friday, we're pretty much seven to eight days away from the next Friday. This is Pocket Now Daily. That's our day off with Windows 8.1. Microsoft has just made the software public as a preview when Adam Lane takes us through a full video of what to expect with these changes. So far, they do seem very good. A lot of reliability changes, a lot of new enhancements, really cool features coming up. Hit links in the description for full details on the video. But aside from that, we've also got some leaked screen form factors that are coming up. Seven inches is one, and then we've got a 10.6 inch retina display graphics display coming up. Could this be the next Surface? Blackberry's up next, but sadly not for good news. The company is struggling terribly with their quarter results. They're down in just about everything, but probably the worst part is that they've only sold 6.8 million units within the quarter, which is pretty much the amount of Nokia Lumias that were sold. But wait a second, that 6.8 million is only made of 2.7 million BlackBerry 10 units, meaning that BlackBerry, you know, the Z10 is not really taking off. And to make matters worse, those of you playbook owners, all three of you out there, you're not getting BlackBerry 10. That's already confirmed. So let's see what happens to the company eventually. And now that the Sony Xperia Z Ultra is public, there's still one code name left in the previous leaks from a couple of months ago, which is the Onami. And the question is, what are we getting? We've got some leaked photographs of the phone and well, we've got a Xenon flash. We've got an interesting metal edge and also a weird sort of leathery texture. Stay tuned for the leak says probably this phone will come out in the next couple of months. Hopefully EFA. Now let's talk about Android 4.3, and no, we don't know when Google's announcing it. This is probably one of the biggest mysteries of the year, but interesting, there's already a leak ROM for the Galaxy S4 out there. Links in the description on how to get it at your own risk, but no, we still don't know what features are coming, what are the changes, so stay tuned, we'll keep you posted on the updates, and hopefully a date for when this is gonna be announced. And finally, for the interesting news of the day, Google makes headlines again as they're working on three products that you already knew of. They're working on a smartwatch, which everybody is, and then they're working on a game console, which we thought they weren't, but apparently they are. And third, apparently they're working on a cheaper version of the Nexus Q, and the reason why this is news is because apparently Android 5.0 is for this. They're building a new operating system that will allow Android to easily scale to very different form factors and very different usages, or usage scenarios would be the right way to say it. But anyways, it's really hard to know when these products are gonna come up, and as we just talked, Android 4.0 4.3 is not even on the timeline. We still don't know any dates. So 5.0 is probably even further down the road. So that leads me to the question of the day. Are you waiting on any of these products from Google now that you have Google Glass or that some people have it? You have a smartwatch, a Nexus Q, or a cheaper one, and you also have the option for a game console. Is there anything here that you're waiting for? In my particular case, I'd prefer a smartwatch from Google than Google Glass, but leave us a comment down below. Of course, as always, for an earlier scoop of everything that's happening in the smartphone and tablet world, make sure you follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter at Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you next week.